Now, your KSBW weather forecast with Chief Meteorologist Lee Solomon. Good evening, everybody. Quick recap here of the day. It was warm. Did you feel that? I mean, if you were in the valleys, even in the hills, in some cases, we got to 70 Scotts Valley, middle 60s, upper 60s, Santa Cruz. Those were not the warmest numbers, though. We had widespread 70s uh, from San Juan Batista to Hollister uh, to Morgan Hill, low 70s, a little cooler uh, over in Moss Landing. Generally, they are 61 degrees. Look at some of these numbers, though. 80 in Soledad, 79 in Greenfield, 78 in King City. It's almost like Summer came for a visit real quick. Mid 60s, Monterey, PG, about 63 in Marina this afternoon. We had some breeze coming in out of the south. We're in between two systems. One's heading to the north, this one, and it's got a weak cold front that's coming in right now, and we're seeing some clouds from that. And then there's a slug of moisture, kind of like an atmospheric river that's going down into Southern California, but there's nothing to really spin it up. So there's moisture in the atmosphere and they'll get a few showers, but you know, not a, not a real widespread soaking rain. We're going to get what we get out of the northern part of this thing. And here it is, There's a very weak front that'll move through and just kind of wash out. So it doesn't have a lot going for it, but it'll bring us some clouds and uh, maybe a couple of showers. We'll see. The best chance is obviously going to be north of San Francisco, uh, but the front will come through. So if you get a few sprinkles overnight and a few showers, that's what that is. And it could be around for the morning commute too. So that could impact you a little bit. Future cast showing the overall program here. One weakening cold front. You're going to see it kind of just disappear as it comes over us because it's weakening and falling apart. There's not much left of it by tomorrow morning. And then we see more of the moisture actually coming up from the south. Uh, tomorrow evening, so kind of a repeat, but this time coming up from the south for another chance of showers tomorrow evening. Better chance actually Monterey, Salinas and southward with this one obviously coming up from the south. That would make sense. That passes through on Friday and then we'll watch for something on Saturday. So it's kind of little bits and pieces here as we go through the next uh, 48 to 72 hours. This is Saturday 830 in the morning. Looks like a warm front comes up from the south keeping our temperatures mild, but keeping the rain as a chance, certainly as we go into Saturday. That's really our best chance, by the way, of getting more of a widespread, at least light to moderate rain would be Saturday. Futurecast showing it close up now. A couple of showers possible with this front tonight. Again, a couple of drops here and there. And then by tomorrow morning, it's pretty much done. Maybe a leftover raindrop. And then tomorrow afternoon, even some clearing for a little bit of sun in the afternoon. It'll still be mild too. Clouds coming back in though tomorrow night. More showers possible. Carmel. Salinas and southward, so kind of different than you normally think from Santa Cruz north, but this time it'll be more of a southerly trajectory, but not much. And then again, the bigger chance will be on Saturday, so we'll keep a watch on that. Mostly cloudy tonight, 40 to 47. We'll put a chance of some light rain or sprinkles or showers. Overnight lows kind of mild, mid 40s to upper 40s of the coast, some low 40s for the valleys, no 30s tonight. And for tomorrow, mostly cloudy, chance of a few light rain showers in the morning and then back to partly cloudy. So again, not a big deal. Uh, your uh, temps are going through the next couple of days. 60s to near 70, even with the rain chances, because it's all mild as we go through the uh, seven to eight day forecast here. The best chance is going to be on Saturday. And then as we go through early next week, we'll clear it up for a couple of days and then get back into some colder systems with better chances of showers. By the way, we're going to spring forward over the weekend, Aaron. So you're going to want to see. Yes, we are. A bunch of years <laughs> back, they changed the laws up. So, you know, for us folks that are used to the old school way, yeah. it's, it's a little earlier. And the overnight low is mostly in the 40s. And a better chance, really, of more significant rains probably middle of next week with colder systems and lowering snow levels and all that. We'll but we got a chance. Crossed. You know, we we'll kind of grab every little drop we can through the month. Well, month. if we could do another storm like we had last week, that would help. I'll take that. Yeah, exactly. <laughs>